Hello, everybody. Welcome back to more Loop Hero. We are going to try for an Act 3 victory here today. We got the river unlocked, which should make that apparently quite a bit easier. Uh, yeah. Uh, we got another upgrade on the watchtower in between videos. I decided I did want it since we were trying to go for the big, the big bad here. I feel like it might be pretty decent. I am bringing the swamp and uh, vampire mansion combo again because I think that it might be good here now since we are not bringing the desert which would lower basically lowering the hp of the mosquitoes meant that we could potentially kill them and you know they would blow up in our face yada yada uh we're also this does does lower the hp of our skeletons as well which is problematic so i think that forest river is probably the way to go here uh, I have ditched the wheat fields because they just junk my hand too much. And if my hand is junked, that means I can't play my cards and spawn the ba uh, the, the bad boy, <laughs> the boss, quicker, which is kind of important. I'm bringing the road lantern just as kind of like a, uh, a whoopsie. Like, you know, like maybe I accidentally, since I'm just trying to keep things in check, you know, we could accidentally spawn it in a, in a really rough, or in a spot where we have a really rough time bringing the ancestral crypt because we are the necromancer uh and it's do i think it's necessarily better for the necromancer than the other one probably probably but at the same time part of me just wants it because if the other characters can't really utilize it you know okay so we actually can only put it wait what's this oh we can only put this on the perimeter. Doubles the effect of adjacent landscape tiles. So if we put it up like this and we run it alongside, then we loop it back around, I guess. There's probably some other uh, optimal way of doing it. We're back at it again with the old mountains, effectively. There's our swamp. What do we get? I match HP. I think we want to prioritize maybe like skeleton levels and a couple things like that a little bit more. Got our river. And there is our blood grove. So we will be putting that down, but only in spots where we can force there to be no blood golem to spawn. We're going to bring the blood grove. We will put some down, but only if they intercept or get intercepted by villages that are not ransacked. That is the only situation where we will be putting those down. Um... Uh, you know, fingers crossed that this truly does work. Mosquitoes have souls for some reason. So, spiders don't. People are like, oh, what are you? of course spiders don't have souls. Of course they don't have souls. Spiders obviously don't have souls. Why do mosquitoes have souls then, man? Explain that. You can't. Insects don't have souls, but, but mosquitoes do. What's a mosquito then, man? What is a mosquito then, if not an insect? I'm so confused. I think it's... I, I genuinely think the answer is that the, it is a uh, it is a balance issue. Like, they needed to be like, I know that this doesn't quite... Quite track. But... Boy, it'd be way too easy to get souls if you could get them from spiders. I genuinely think that might even be the answer. Uh, okay. So, if we put a blood grove... Okay, so if we loop right like this. If we put a blood grove here, we could put the ruins there since they would always die before we fight the boss. But then we can't heal immediately before the boss. I don't think that'll matter. So we can't put any over here. That will be a... That would be a problem. Just straight up. Okay. So we have summon quality. We have 14% summon quality. Not bad. Alright. Didn't take nothing. We got our first village here. So I probably... So also... Hmm. If we put this here... So it spawns chest at the start of each loop. If we put it right here, we should get really good equipment at the beginning of every single loop. Adjacent tiles can become ghosts, though. 
I think that's okay. We'll just not put anything in that exact perimeter that can become a ghost if we don't want ghosts. It's weird because it, it is a way to potentially generate more souls, though. We have no, um, we have no wheat field, so we don't have to care about that anymore, anymore. Okay, should we spawn bandits? It's fine. We could oblivion the bandits. We got it early enough. Sounds good to me. All right. Good stuff. Good stuff. I'm liking this. We got ourselves a book. All right, well, we got to begin to look at our, uh, our equipment now after this. Okay, so there's our thicket, our forest. So that should be 2% attack speed. 4%. So I guess we have 6%, but then I guess we're getting a fraction from something else. All right, this is obviously a bit, like, a bit concerning. Oh, we got bodied. Skeleton's too strong. Am I going to really get bitten in the butt? Am I going to really get bitten in the butt that quickly? I mean, we got to make sure we get really good magic HP. Attack speed, regen per second, skeleton level. I don't care that much about the regen. What was this? Summon quality. We, I think we want to keep that a little bit here. Sure. I feel like the three might, you know. Is it going to make a big difference? Eh, maybe not. Probably not. But it might make some. So that's 4% attack speed? That is crazy how quick that works. Uh, the question, should I put down the ruins right now? So we'll probably want to put down a forest and a uh, a blood grove there then. Yeah, forest blood grove. Because then it would capture this and this, and it couldn't spawn any blood golems as long as we don't ransack it. It and it's not really going to spawn nothing yet. So oh, do we do it? We do it. We'll we'll change that up in a little bit. Obviously, I will want that summon quality. Oh, that's so huge. That's so nice. It's basically like getting a... It's the closest you can get to mono statting. So that is quite nice. More. More. Oblivion. Uh, okay, well, I'm, I'm really happy that we have that as an option. Evasion, summon quality, summon level. I will replace this soon. But not right now. Okay, so this is exciting. Ah, uh, that is that is certainly the correct way of doing that. Attack speed, evasion, summon quality. That's really good. So, yeah, we get the level 3 stuff literally at the exact start of the loop. That is 100%. 100% the meta for that. It's a it's a power spike literally the second we start the loop. That's, that's important. That is important. Where do we put this other one, though? Do we... Put it right here. It spreads two blood things. What happens if we put villages there afterwards? You'd probably cover it, right? Um, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Can we? We can. Okay. I'll leave it there for now. I'll leave it there for now. I probably should have just put it there. I think it'll be okay, though. I mean, any of those blood guys will have souls any anyhow. Regen and max skeletons up? Sure. Like, I, I, as mentioned, I don't super care. Wow, we're, like, weirdly strong against these guys. Big. 
All right. So our attack speed is pretty solid already, which is great. Okay, so thicket we'll put over here. The forest we'll put right here to preempt that there. Shall I? Oh, I cannot put it directly on there. So okay, so I, I I was I'm I'm glad. I thought that we could maybe like take it over. Alright. Works fine for me so far. Safasa fine, Safasa fine. Anything we want to lantern? Probably not. I feel like the lantern may have been a uh, not super necessary thing. Maybe we'll want it there. Oh, wow. Wait, was this the same thing we already had to pick from? Max. Okay, across the board, that's just like really. That's really good stuff. I, I, I should have probably picked that up in the beginning with. Summon quality is 46%. That's good. I think we keep what we've got for now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. These smelly little fools. We can summon four, right? We can indeed. All right, what do we got? Permanent 0.5 bonus to energy armor for every summoned skeleton. There's this, which does help us stay alive, obviously. Uh... But getting that as early as we just did with uh, a focus on attack speed, I think is going to be extraordinarily useful. Agent skeleton level, skeleton level, magic H. I mean, the magic HP is really nice. It's all right. Give me another blood grove, please. I'd like another blood grove, please. What if we ransacked this village? And then we oblivion to the vampire right away. We should be fine. We should be fine. We're not gonna die right now, especially not without the vampire. I can't really I can't really picture this being that okay well this that's really tempting I can't picture this being that bad it's not yeah we're we're scaling them hard oh my god we are out scaling this garbage stat hopefully we just get really lucky here and we actually get KOs before we get the blood groves okay it's a legit KO a lot of attack uh, a lot of level up there okay so we lost we lost one we didn't lose it we just didn't didn't get the ko now these ones can't get away magic hp defense regen eh tis a silly thing holy moly it might not necessarily be good, but holy moly. Max skeleton's up. I feel like we can't pass that item up. It's so good. I wouldn't be shocked if we kept that this for uh, the whole time, to be honest. Um... Yeah, I don't know if we got anything we want to use, but that doesn't mean it's not, like, really, really good to have that there. Okay, we got another one. Should we... A little concerning, but we'll do it. Summon quality. Big no. Very large no. I feel like the vi village question marks are not that big of a deal for us. Theoretically. Awesome get. Okay, so we want to make sure we do this like that. And we go here and then down, and we just loop. We snake it up like that.
All right. I mean, if, if anything, what will body us? Mosquitoes? Mosquitoes would. I guess we could have put that up there, huh? What the hell is that sound? I mean, we're really doing just fine right now. They, have, they are certainly giving me uh, a wee bit of concern. To the point where I almost think we shouldn't necessarily put down another swamp yet. The thing is, when more of them spawn, it won't be that bad. However, are they going to start spawning more? Start spawning more, huh? Okay, our attack speed is already at 54%. That is wild. That is crazy good. Crazy good. We're not very far along on our meter. Okay, we're getting we're getting a little messed up here, but that's okay. We we kind of this is an investment. This is an investment here. That's okay. This is not scary in the slightest. Oh, not even a little, man. Not even a little, not even at all. Okay. One of them bad boys, bad boys. Bonus resurrection charge. Could we look at this as like 10% more attack speed? Kind of. Let's try it out. I should probably have get like picked up the resurrection charge. Don't get me wrong. I'm well aware. Sounds kind of fun, you know? Hack speed evasion, some equality. Yep, that's a little bit more interesting to me. This is what? This is the middle thing. Alright. Hack speed. I mean, I, I guess we could have. We could have totally. Ah, uh, we really should have put this just right here. Right? Because then we would get the them to fight with us. Oh well. Because it would spawn here, uh, a blood path here and actually, he or here and actually here as well, even though it looked like it would only spawn it right here. Uh, that spawns three of them. That's fine by me. Loses 1.5 HP every second. This is not proving to be concerning. And this is an elite one. You know, this would, it'll be fine. I am hardly concerned. And there is a free extra soul for us. A. Unless they don't count because we've already killed them once. Nope, they count. Oh, that's annoying. It's annoying just because I want to put a ruins there. Now we need to put an oblivion down before we can actually put the ruins there. That's... It's certainly a little frustrating. Do we really not have a better ring? I really want to keep that. I need, I, I need to keep that max skeletons. Four is honestly maybe a little too much. I want like five, five or six. Uh. Yeah, is this really like... Why is that? Why is that so much higher level? Really, it's just not super, super big for me right now. There's another river. Neat. Okay. Certainly interested to see how the village fight goes. Okay. This is important. Okay. Here we go. It shouldn't be bad. Right? 
Yeah. I don't think that they can even harm us. Well, it's weird. They can, but only after we've summoned our max amount of skeletons. So skeleton max, max amount of skeletons is actually really important here. Because then we, if we start spawning our max, then we start hitting them. And I believe that reflection damage is actually piercing. Which is not great for us. Okay, I'm excited to see how a double mosquito fight looks. Oh, I thought there was another spot to put a blood grove. Not yet. I feel like we... Yeah, this is super strange. Oh. Wait. Okay. Pretty good, pretty good. Was there summon quality? 71%. I feel like I feel like we want it somewhere around maybe 50% or I mean Obviously it's cooler if it's higher, but Yeah, this is not going how I wanted. I may... I may end up doing a kill upon it. I think we, I think we maybe have to. It's not working. I don't know why it's really not working though. We, like we, it's, I guess it, I, it must be because it's act three. It, it must be that. I thought it was because of the HP. I, I thought it was because of the HP, but no, I guess that's not the only thing at all. We already have a hundred percent attack speed, which is awesome. Really, really, really good. Okay. This should be of no concern. Twasn't. Which is awesome. To have something that's not a concern there. Ooh. Uh, so skeleton level goes up to 4.58. That seems big. Seems big. Attack speed. Okay, well, we lose the max skeleton stuff. I, like, I want this, but I can't really afford to lose the max skeleton stuff. I need another one of those somewhere. Oh, hey. Do it. There we go. That's a, that's a substantial amount of magical HP now. Okay. Okay. We have another ruins. I would have liked to put it here. Okay. Yes, yeah, it's, it's really just the swamp situation that's causing uh, the woes, you know? Good. Put this here, then it would spawn one of right there. Is that a problem? If I do this, then those could all turn spawn extra ghosts. I guess that's the concern, huh? Put it here. What does that do? Turns that one. <laughs> Turns all three. Rip. Did not want to turn all three. I did not want to turn all three, but we do have these guys, which should help. It might not be a problem. 
I don't know. I don't have a whole lot of experience with it, so that's, you know, it's certainly concerning in that regard. Apparently, there is not a cap anymore on attack speed. That's another lie that I have, have apparently been told, which <laughs> it's, it's a bummer because I've been limiting myself in that regard, apparently. Like, there, you get some kind of, like, defensive penalty at a certain point. I don't know if that's quite as important with the Necromancer since you're spawning your defensive tools with your attack speed, you know? Nice. These probably don't get double up effects, is my guess. Right? They probably don't get double up effects. Definitely not sure about that. Okay, well, this worked out really well. We actually didn't end up taking damage. Okay, that's big. Grove this one. Where do we... I don't know if we can... Oh, we'd have to thicket. Thicket Blood Grove. That's fine. That's fine to me. I don't know if I want them to turn into ghosts. What happens if we put this here? doesn't spawn an extra chest, does it? I mean, for science. For science. What's the worst case? It does nothing. I don't know if I was going to put it down anyways. Oh, it's actually the worst. No. Uh, some quality. What are we at? Okay, we're actually down a little bit more than I would like to be. Because I want to summon the tanky boys. Okay, wow. That's a lot of, that's a lot of vampire castles there I, that I... Didn't quite want. Okay. Uh, let's put this away for a second so I can just... Ooh, that's not... That's not great. It's not great to have it there with the vampire. We'll oblivion that one for now. I just, uh, yeah, I don't want it there with the vampire. I was just trying to make sure that these don't get accidentally, like, uh, picked up with a whole bunch of other stuff. I don't, I don't know what else would really go there. Okay, so how does this fight go? I was actually kind of hoping a mosquito would spawn. One. Okay, so that works out really well. That's working out totally well. At this point. I think we can handle it. I think we can handle it. Good. It, it, it might bite us in the butt big time. But it also might not. We got this in case we get another ruins. You. No, thank you. No, thank you. Oh. Okay. We'll fight these guys and then we'll oblivion them and put down the ruins afterwards. Okay. Uh oh. We actually don't really want a tanky guy in here. Kind of funny. And then we'll start attacking. This is actually working out pretty perfect. Keep on spawning weaklings. Oh, yeah, as mentioned, I don't want the tanky guy that bad. Uh-oh. Okay, they're actually dying quickly enough. Okay, now that we're down to one, we should be totally okay. I wish there was, like, a sort-by-stat setting. 
where you can like hover over if you, what if you hovered over a certain stat down here and it would make it so it would highlight the items you have that went with it okay oh cool Cool, 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 cool. But yeah, getting a max skeleton up without having to have the proper um, equipment for it, I feel like it's kind of... It's, it doesn't seem like it should maybe be that big of a deal of a, for a perk, but it is totally a big deal for a perk. Like, I, I really, really want five max skeletons. Ideally, we get like six. Oh, we should probably kill these... Uh, we should probably ditch the the thieves. I think that they could cause problems for sure. Oh, I think they could really cause problems. Okay, do we not get a soul for that? Do we not get a soul for it because they killed it? Question mark? Okay, so we have another village. We have plenty of vampire mansions. <laughs> um. Village. Holy moly, look how many are here. want something with max skeleton so bad right now we could maybe replace this and we could maybe replace our necklace that was not bad at all ghost yeah I, I guess I'm just confused about where to put down the village could go village village wait single ruins eh. uh village ruin ruin i like that hold on though that's too far ah, it's too far down to do that this is actually like annoyingly in the way and i'm pretty sure a blood golem can spawn here yeah, that actually that actually blocks me out of doing what I'm doing up here. Okay, well this is this is gonna be a test right here for sure. I think we'll be okay. Ah? Big Max uh, or Magic HP up as well. Regen, skeleton level. I don't care about the regen, really. That one's the leading one for now. Sound quality, attack speed, skeleton level. All right, there we go. We'll replace that one now. I just want to stay at five for sure. I mean, I would like to get to six, but only if the other stuff on there on the uh, ring is pretty decent as well. That, oh, that sound, man! There's our blood groove. Oh, another blood groove. Ooh. Grove. 
it. Th those are the problem. Is there anywhere we can put this where it only gets the village? Not, no. Yeah, I think we oblivion the uh, the bandit camps at this point. I think that's where we're at with that. All right. I'm feeling relatively decent here. Someone said we need to fight this boss by loop six. How the hell do you get enough... I'm so confused. How the hell do you get enough uh, experience to fight the boss that fast? How? How? What am I missing there? Is, isn't it just based off of tiles placed? Am I crazy? Okay. I think that's pretty good. Max skeleton attack speed evasion level. I can actually sacrifice that one. That's not that big of a not that big of a deal. Okay, we got our max skeletons to five. I feel like that was a mistake. Wait, did that other thing have max skeletons? I, I guess I it must have, right? Because I could have sworn we were already at five. Whoops. Yeah, these fights are proving to not be uh, not be problematic, which is really nice. Another river. Um. Uh, Every four days. where we'd put a blood, another battlefield at this point. Okay. Another ruins. We sure as shoot got a spot for that. Point. It's not going to spawn anything in time. So you are going to get blood growth, which is nice, but yeah, I, I would love these guys to go the hell away. <laughs> I would love for them to go the hell away. Four, three, two, one. Good. We like that. That's super ideal. At this point, I really do think we can just spawn the swamps. They, they seem like they're not causing issues. With that sound. What is that? Okay. I'm doing just fine. Just fine. Just fine. All right, so that's all fulfilled up there. Oh my god, we keep on getting these dupes on the uh, on the rivers. I want to get them on the dang forests. I wish I could put a road lantern right here. All right. Four, three. So, they're, yeah, they're actually going to get consumed there. Skeletons. We almost had a level. Not even close. Not even close. I kind of want to do the vampire thing down, on, down south as well there. But again, we kind of need an Oblivion. I would not hate the get a handful of Oblivion thing. I would really not hate that at all. Yeah, I can't really sacrifice any max skeletons at this point. Our, our book we could maybe replace as a result. Uh, and there is a ring we could theoretically replace as well. But these ones are not, they're not wowing me. They are not wowing me at the moment. <laughs> Did they 
Mage and Summon quality. Sure. Even more sure. That Okay, well, that's good. That's really good. Maybe sacrifice something now if we get like a really, really good replacement. I don't think we have a really good replacement right now. Some quality is at 52%, which is nice. This doesn't look like a this one doesn't look like a book to me at all. It doesn't even look close to a book. It looks like a robe. I wouldn't hate defense. Regen, I feel like it's not the most crucial for us. I wouldn't hate defense and evasion. But like regen in specific is a stat that for this character right now for us. Okay, so yeah, this needs to change. We're gonna be fine, clearly. But that's gotta go. That's gotta go. This guy's wrecked. If those guys turned into ghosts, it wouldn't be a problem at all. Okay. Eh, it's fine. Chest gauntlets. Magic HP, defense, regen, evasion, summon quality. Eh. Eh. This stuff's booty. I mean, this guy's definitely an annoying fight. But it's because he's an elite. He's a super elite because of the, uh, the Count's Lands, isn't it? Okay. We're getting there. Yeah, it's loop eight, and I I feel like I've placed almost everything. Like we placed such a huge amount of stuff, and we're uh, we're getting bodied. Or no, we're not. We're not really getting bodied at all. But you know what I'm saying. Uh. Sure. 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 Where's the shirt? Yeah, like, I feel like we need some Oblivions to start putting down new tiles without them kind of uh, wrecking us on accident. I feel like that'd be super, super good. Because if we put, if we get an Oblivion, we can put down the, uh, the Vampire Mansion. All right, so we're done with the river over here. We're going to probably start one over on the left. Like, I don't really necessarily want to Oblivion these fights, because I don't find them, they're not bad for us. It's more just, I don't want to do this fight with a vampire, because that's when it could really, it could get out of control, silly, actually. I truly, truly think we, uh, uh, the amount of difficulty it would boost this fight would be pretty big. Like, we can fight four of those guys. It'll take a while. It's It'll be an annoying slog, but it, we can do it. Okay. Summon quality, big boost. What's up with the summon quality? The, 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 the gray items are so weird for this character. For the necromancer, like, the gray, um... Ba -ba 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 -ba. Like, max skeleton up. It's, it's plus one max skeleton if it's a level one. It's plus one max skeleton if it's a level 11. It just doesn't matter. It's always going to be plus one. It's super weird. Oh, God. I want to play stuff so bad. We're going to be here forever otherwise. It's a pretty big boost. All right. All right. So we, we wreck. We certainly wreck. I really wish we could just spawn the boss, but... We're going to need to just bite the bullet at some point, I guess. All 
All right, let me try. I'm trying to compare that. It's just like we gained two percent summon quality. How big of a deal is that, really? I don't know. I feel like it's not a big deal. Good stuff. Oh, you can only have one river. Oh. This is not a thing I knew. Shoot. Oh, I really did not know that. Poop. 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 There's not really much of anywhere I really want to put this down. It might be in our best interest to put it there for now. Like, I, I just really want to move my bar. If we don't start putting stuff down, we're going to have a bad time soon. Same thing. I'll, I'll sacrifice one, one spawn there uh, to make it so this doesn't get out of control, I guess. Do we spawn multiple vampires? I don't know if that spawns multiple vampires. Have another battlefield, I guess. Ah, this is all really annoying. I, I feel like, should we just put it down here? I feel like these guys don't gain the, the life steal effect, but that's not what I'm talking about for why it would turn into a problem. It's just because uh, it would give, it would put a unit in the fight that can actually attack us, which is the concern. We should have looped this up right here. All right. How are we only here? How are we only here? Does each thing like provide its own unique amount? All right. Okay, so there's only one vampire. Okay. There would be two, theoretically, if if they if it works how my brain was telling me. Yeah, there's a double overlap there, so. Oh, that was almost close. Okay, NBD. Really good. Okay, so we have a Ruins. We don't want to put it down until we can put down a blood grove, though. It's a little jank. Oh, I'm so glad that there's not that doesn't stack multiple vampires. That does give me a, like a really good spot to put them up here. It really does help. Level up. Three strengthened skeletons join the hero on every loop to help in battle. Uh, resurrection charge. I'm going to go with the horde for now. I just feel like it'll be nice. I just feel like it'll be nice. Yeah, these guys aren't really concerns for me. Can we get that blood grow, please? Can we get that sweet, sweet blood grove? Oh, wait. Where would we put it? Oh, hell. Oh, hell. Oh, 
Es ist super annoying. I feel like we need an oblivion to make this work in a non-stupid way. I'm pretty frustrated by a lot of this. This, the fact that this is a wiggly corner here is causing some problems. Hmm. <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? Yeah, it's nowhere we can put that anymore. God, that sound! It's wretched! We're really strong, but if we just don't... If we can't spawn the boss sometime soon here... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Evasion, regen, defense... I mean, it's a lot of defensive stuff. Six, six max skeletons, though. I feel like we'll go a long way. Where am I? Okay. Okay. Oh man, I wish that the boss was here right now, right now. Uh, a little bit more of a, it's just, it's roughly the same thing, but like marginally worse, I guess. Sure. I really love the river card, though. I understand it a little bit better now. I feel like, yeah, we'll have to, uh, we'll have to adjust things a little bit. You know, this could be worth it. That could be worth it. Genuinely. Attack speed evasion. All right, we got our swamp. Let's get stupid with it. Try it so hard! We got the 10% chance to place another tile and we're still having those issues, you know? Oi, oi, oi. Whoa! They stole the one I was wearing! Is that the one that we wanted? or some call like 26 percent absolutely hooligans but I I haven't gotten a, an oblivion so I can't I don't know like what can I what am I supposed to do what am I supposed to do dude Maybe on this loop we'll get it, but honestly, I kind of doubt it. I feel like, I, I don't know what's up. I don't know why it's so, so challenging to, oh, that's tempting. Oh, that's really tempting. It's a big, big shield. I don't know why it's so challenging to, to get the meter filled up right now. It, we're 53 minutes in. I feel like we normally would have seen it the end by now. Like each, uh, each tile has to have its own separate experience gain. It has to. And we must have a pretty bad selection for gaining experience. That's the only thing I could think. Like, for it to have taken this long is so wild. Oh. Okay. Let's hope for some dupes. You know, I don't 
don't want to put it here because then we have to fight these guys. Like, they, they suck. They suck. Fine on these. Yeah, these, the fact that these river cards, too, like, aren't going to be giving us anything. Do we get experience when we, like, cycle through our cards? Or something? Alright, how does this go? Okay, it's actually not proving to be that bad. Alright, 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 alright. I was a little too worried about this over nothing, I guess. Alright, I feel like we have to kill the, uh, the thieves on the left, right? This, okay, so this does suck. That did that did stink. That was bad. And now it's worse. However, I feel like that's got to go. It's like it, it could potentially steal our equipment immediately before the boss, right when we want to fight him. You know, that's a problem. We have a blood grove. Don't we? Yeah, we have a blood grove. Okay, this is a non problematic spot to put one. So we could actually end up putting a well, we could put a ruins here, but then he's going. He is going to fight that. Uh, does that matter? I don't think that matters. We got another ruin. We're running out of spots to put stuff. How is this boss not spawned? The hell! What the hell? I'm running out of tiles. How is the boss not spawned? Is it because of the river? The redundant river stuff, I guess? If the if we don't spawn the boss on this loop, we're there's like no hope, I think. There there's like maybe hope if we can fight the boss right now. Please don't steal anything I'm wearing. That's all. Like, but we're finally starting to get scaled out, which is really annoying. Okay, we are... <sighs> oh! I think we take that. Five. All right, we have a summon quality of 81. We should summon some pretty good skeletons pretty frequently. Theoretically, of course. Please. How to spawn boss. We do have our revive stuff still, so that's pretty good. Man, like I wish it went up just like a fraction just based off of kills and stuff because we are swimming in it in that case. I just don't, yeah, I don't really see it happening right now. Like we can put down this stuff. We have another vampire mansion. Like there's nothing, yeah, we can totally... Totally put down another vampire mansion right there, yada yada. The fact that we can't put down these river cards is, is rough. It is it is certainly rough. Uh is there nowhere else we can put this without it causing a problem? No, it's gonna cause a problem anywhere. 
As will this. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. What is a guy to do? The hell is a guy to do? We just need to get thickets and stuff, but it's just not happening. Just like, if I if I can't spawn the boss, I, I can't fight the boss. And if, it just feels like it's... We're running into a spot where we pretty much, yeah, can only use our, our thickets and stuff. Which is super, super a bummer. We're almost at 200% attack speed, which is cool. Okay. Summon quality of agents and levels. Got some level. Just a little bit of defense. Let's gain a little bit of skeleton level. Sure. Sure. Like, we're doing fine against these, and I don't really predict we have we run into an issue where we have... Or, yeah, I don't, I don't really predict that we run into an issue against these normal fights, really. But I do think, like, the longer it takes before we summon the boss, the worse we are. Like, we're going to have a really, really, really hard time. And there's nothing we can do about it right now. There's actually nothing I can do about it right now. So I'm just, I literally am not getting cards that will let me level up my, uh, my boss spawn meter. We're an hour in. We're an hour in and I haven't done it. And honestly, I don't even know if I'll do it this loop. I'm consigned. I guess it's all the dead river draws. I, I certainly... I don't know. Oh, well. Uh, evasion Mexico Thumb. We lose the 26% summon quality, but we gain 50 shield. Okay. For right now, sure. If we do not sp summon the boss on this loop, I am going to loop my mind. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Whoa there. Now that's spicy. Okay. About dang time, we got another forest to place. Thank you. Man, this thing is getting rough. Oh, thank the heavens. Please give me a dupe. Oh, it's not moving! <laughs> it's just like not moving. We're gonna just get bodied because we just can't, we can't close the loop. I just can't close the loop. Oh, there we go. Now you give me everything. Wow. Wow. That took forever. Road Lantern. At this point, sure. If we oblivion something somewhere, can will it allow us to put down more stuff? Is there anywhere that if we oblivion something, we can put down more stuff? What happens if we oblivion, like, this connection? You can't oblivion a river at all. It's not even possible. Ooh, interesting. That doesn't do anything, but it also doesn't do anything, you know? Win-win. No, it doesn't help us, but it also pushes our meter along. All right, I think we can spawn in this loop, but I genuinely, I think there's a chance we can beat him because we are really, really strong. But I, I, 
boy, we would have. I think we would have had a much better chance last loop. I think we would have had a much better chance. Okay, this is a great ring. Sure, we can have. Uh, wait, I thought, I thought that would put us up to seven. I replaced the wrong ring. Oh no, I did. I think I. I think that that's. I think that's an okay trade there. Uh, attack speed. Let's see. Summon quality is currently at fifty-six percent. I do not want to go lower than that, really. Where the hell are we? Oh my god. Boink. Oh, King. Got another village. I literally can't put down another tile. I literally cannot put down another tile on my loop. And the boss is in here. There's got to be some kind of different level weight to the cards, right? There's got to be. Okay, well, we'll put that down. We can't oblivion something and then put something down to gain meter because we just end up losing meter out of the mix. But we pretty much literally need to get perimeter things. Okay, okay, well, that's... Never mind, I can't put down the swamp. We can put down the thicket, though. I want to put that down, but I want to put that down later. Just in case... We have to do another loop. Which, at, at this point, it looks like this is our final loop. I think we should be good. But, like, the fact that it's taking this long is a little, little loopy. But I'm bum. Oh, thank you. Okay, that's big. Oh, that's really big. Not big enough. We get, uh, like, two more thickets we can also place down. Yeah, our, our blood grove here. That could be good. All right. Oh, my God. 231% attack speed, huh? Where would it make the least problems? Okay. Wait. Shoot. Wait, no, this is good. 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 It's gonna be helpful for now. Oh, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I'm really worried about the bandit fight. Not because I'm worried about the bandit, but because I'm worried that they're gonna steal my stuff. Not worried about dying. I want one less chance to lose my stuff. You gotta be kidding me! You've gotta be kidding me! Are you serious? No! Put that on for now. Oh, that is so annoying! We better get an amazing one. Oh. Uh, the loop that we're finally gonna spawn him! My book was so good! I mean, do, truth be told, I genuinely don't know if we even should fight him. Like, I think we're gonna get maybe bescrewed. Uh, I feel like summon quality might be important here. Like, because we need to make sure we get the guys that taunt, you know? Please. 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 
Please. Please. Please. Please! Oh my god! This game! Are you serious? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh my god! Why? Oh my god. Please. So we got the taunter. That's important. I can't, man. That was that was wretched. Oh, uh, we are getting just memed on today. So our summon qualities should be good. Oh, I mean that's that's important. <laughs> Are you for real? Oh my god. <laughs> Please give me one more thicket. Just one more thing that we can place down. Do we have anything else we can place down? No. There we go. We've done it. We've spawned the boss. An hour 11 in, we have spawned the boss. Please let me make it there. I mean... Okay. Let me think about something. Where'd my oblivion go? Oh my god, it just got pushed off. Uh oh. It's fine. Very fine. I feel like we're fine for summon quality. Four, three, two, one, good. Oh no. HP back, is it? We're not going to get full healed. I mean, these guys aren't going to do damage to us. This is a thing I know. Our regen is non-existent, pretty much. Okay. Do we have a, we do have a good book after? Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Super weird. Oh. Well, this is fine. <laughs> we're putting on the regen for now. I don't know that we're going to keep it. Oh. My heart. My heart. We might get healed pretty well. I don't know. Maybe we'll be fine. We have a couple we have a couple villages left. And this regen does seem to be making a difference. I don't know that we should bring it to the boss fight. Okay. Well, we're going to be probably not at full. But we're going to be okay-ish for health. I'm not gonna. I that was not me saying we're gonna win. I don't know that that's. I don't know that that's a reality at all. But you know, 
Okay, so that's a really good one. That is what we'll put on. Okay. We're in planning mode after this. I sort of expect defeat, you know? Ooh. Which one was it? I guess it was this one. What are the odds of victory? Uh, 0.33. Repeating, of course. I, I gotta know. After, to, after this big old effort we put in today, I gotta give it a shot. Right? Like, we die, we lose a lot. I'm well aware. I have to, like... I have to give it a shot today. If I did all of that just to leave, I would lose my mind. The hunt begins. Get him. Whoa. All right. We got the tank. Oh, my God. He gets bodied. Okay. Summon tank. Summon tank. Summon tank. Summon tank. Thank you. Oh, my God. Summon tank. Summon tank. Summon tank. Summon tank. Thank you. Blessed be to summon quality. Summon tank, summon tank, summon tank. Let's go. Let's go. Woof. We're not, we haven't won yet. Let's go. <laughs> uh, that was so much fun. What a shame. Cornered by my own target and killed. Now tell me everything you know. Oh, please, you don't really think that this is the moment when I acknowledge your power and tell you all I know out of sheer respect, do you? I'm dying here, you know? Not a great time for revelations, and also, you've killed my hounds. You blinker. <laughs> you think I feel good about that? I Don't confuse your motivation with mine. I hope you don't have this annoying habit of coming back to life unharmed, do you? Right now, while I'm still dying, a new body has already been made for me in the heart of the greatest black hole. So yes, I'll be back. Don't think that everything is so simple. My hunt shall continue, and there's no place in the universe where I couldn't track you down. You don't have to make things so complicated. I'm not going anywhere, and I'm not going to hide. I feel better knowing that you're wasting your time fighting me instead of destroying other worlds. I hear the sound of a horn and the barking of my loyal hounds. A new hunt begins. A new hunt! You guys are real... These guys are a real nuisance. They give me hope, though. They wouldn't waste their time on me if I wasn't a real threat to their goal. Oh, my God, man. Once per battle, hero does four hits with double the speed when health falls below 20%. Neat. 40% chance not to spend a healing potion on use. 60% chance to reflect a ranged shot into a random enemy. That's really high. Reflect means that the hero doesn't take it. It is a ranged attack only, but seems pretty useful. Uh, gee, I think we should loop more. No. What happened? Why the shock face? This was nearly torn off. I still don't quite get how I ended up victorious. There, there. I think you're underestimating yourself. I'm serious. That hunter, he had black holes as hounds. I think they could swallow whole planets in the hunter's weapon. The stars went out behind me after every shot. With all that power, he could destroy an entire galaxy. And I'm sure he has already done so a few times. I don't understand how I could be a match to fight him. And I'm afraid I'm realizing it's true for both the Lich and the Priestess as well. Oh, don't tell me this is the encounter that's broken you. This place is becoming better. You mustn't give up. What are you talking about? It's quite the opposite. I'm fully confident that we will succeed. It's not just a coincidence. I have the power to fight this evil, and I have a chance to beat it. Chance to beat it, huh? Well, guess the luck is on your side. Oh, boy. That was a lot, man. That was a lot. But not a lot enough for the library. Makes sense. We did not get much of the uh, Orb of Expansion, I believe. Is that what? 
I don't know. Yeah, I think that's expansion orb. Uh, or rocks. You know, I think maybe tomorrow we will focus up a little bit on um, maybe like Act 2. I think we might have something to still unlock there. I'm not sure. And then, like, come back for... God, for Act 4. No limit on resources. Wow. Enemy strength up by 10%. Bonus resources 120. Eh. Yeah. Spooky. Then let's see. Encyclopedia. Do, do enemies gain... Okay, not everybody gains something on Act 4. Spiders gain Venomous. Chance to poison, do two times loop damage. Oh my god. That actually could end up being spooky. Uh okay, it's kind of exciting to see that, yeah, there's actually not too many act four modifier increases here. That is pretty pretty helpful. Because I was gonna say, like, it's already pretty concerning that they gain the extra power to begin with. <laughs> so that's really nice. All right, but alas, this has been so long. I am done here. That is that, and that is going to do it for today. I will maybe off-camera build some mud huts or something. I, no, probably not even. It takes rocks. Thank you, thank you. Check out the channel for Roguex more every single day, and I will see you next time. Oh, my God. Bye.